Over the past decade, tech entrepreneurs have reinvented the way that we live, whether it be hailing a cab or, or booking a holiday or finding the love of our life. Using the power of the internet, these companies have disrupted and revolutionised the way that we do things. Along the way, digital gatekeepers of information have emerged. Now, we have access to stories and news from across the world at the touch of a button. But at what cost? Who is it that decides what gets to the top of our feeds and our search results? We like to think that these are unbiased, but companies can actually pay to boost their online results. So what does this mean for media? Well, it means that if your journalism doesn't fit the corporate agenda, then you might not make it to page one. At New Internationalist, we care about which voices get heard. And that's why we put grassroots activists, writers and bloggers from all over the world at the centre of everything that we do. We focus on people who've been marginalised and excluded, and we tell the stories that don't get reported elsewhere. For over 43 years, our only obligation has been to our readers and to the people whose stories we cover. In this digital landscape, which is dominated by advertising agencies, independent journalism has never been so important. So if we want to hold our leaders to account and help make a sustainable world, an alternative, robust media is vital. But investigative journalism isn't cheap. Magazine subscriptions alone can't cover all our costs. And you internationalists can't do this without you. So we're asking for your help. We need to raise £30,000 by the end of April. With your support, we can continue to tackle today's most challenging global issues, confront injustice, fight for equality, and amplify the voices of grassroots communities. Investigative journalism is an endangered species. Help us protect it, and together we can keep independent journalism strong. <laughs>